And you have the question? Yes, I do. Yes. And you know where you're going? Yes, I have a GPS and a 4.0 GPA. I think I can figure out how to drive somewhere. Are you wearing that? Anna, in the beginning of the film, does not have any sense or care, really, what she looks like, um, and no fashion sense. But there is a level of, like, uniqueness and cuteness about her. How she starts out, it's a little bit like a little girl puts together to go to school on the first day. We made these shirts uh, on the reverse side of fabric, so it seemed a little faded. And we made these skirts, which seem a little sexy, but very simple. They talk about it in the book that she wears her old blue skirt and some boots. And uh, this also goes with a toggle coat that I designed and we made to complete sort of a little girl look. So when she walks into Gray Enterprises with all the staff there very chicly dressed and in high heels, you get it immediately that she's a fish out of water. <laughs> we did it. We did it. We did it. I know. <laughs> Done. There are a few things I will get emails from Erica, things that she feels her readers would expect to see. One of the things is a dress for Anastasia for her graduation. <laughs> so how long have you two known each other? A gray chiffon dress, which we made out of a silk chiffon. A shapely bodice with a, a sheer piece over it has been a device that's been used since the early part of the 20th century. The shape of the skirt is always feminine and flowing, and the length is just young, but still conservative. Well, that's a hell of a sack, Miss Steele. The only note that I'd gotten from Erica about the plum dress was that it should be fitted. So we chose a very, very fitted plum dress to give Anna the upper hand in the negotiation which in the storyline is borrowed from her roommate, Kate. It's not her dress. She puts it on as some kind of a costume to go into this negotiation. On page five, there are some terms which require clarification. Suspension? Uh, hanging on the ceiling from the Hanging on ropes from the ceiling. <laughs> you got everything you need? There's a dress that Mark Bridges designed and it's the pink dress, and it's so beautiful. <laughs> it's really, it's an incredible dress, and he's so talented. Dance with me. <laughs> this dress, which is a peach chiffon over a peach silk crepe, was inspired by a dress that Faye Dunaway wears in the Thomas Crown Affair. We loved the movie. We thought it had echoes of a relationship with Christian Grey, a billionaire and a girl. So we decided to make this dress for Anastasia. I need more. I want more. How she starts out, it's a little bit like a little girl. And by the journey that we have with her, you see outwardly that she's taken on the influence of Christian and is forever changed. 